Quit. Quit the stream started. No, I'm trying. Sort my hair. Make me look sexy. Sort it. Sort me hair out, Brie. Sort it. Plaff it into a... I don't look like a hobo. Well, I don't know if I can help you with People it. won't drop me money if I look like a stig. A stig? A stig. What's a stig? A stig. A stig. Stig. stig of the gum. Stig of the gum. Stig of the gum. Never watched Top Gear? Yeah, we have. But it's, it's hard to remember all of your weird words. <laughs> all your weird Britishisms. Do you have a slurp of your cold coffee, my darling? No. Just a little slurp. That's mine. Oh, come on. You're very greedy. Fuck. <laughs> I need to wake up too. Uh, yeah, that's true. We're going to the ending. We're going to fight Minerva. Oh, LM is going 50 schmecks. Pez won't unlock Minerva. All right. That's a little rude. 50 schmecks. Let's have it. You're on, mate. What me, fellow Pez? How are you doing? Why are you copying Jack Spadice? I came out, I, I was top of the morning before that guy was even born. I think you're wrong on that. I one. came out the womb top of the morning in. Mm. I looked at the doctor, I was like, top of the morning. But he's actually Irish. <laughs> he is. Yeah, but I'm a peasant, so. And? He's a millionaire. He's a multi millionaire. And? He's disconnected from the working class man. Top of the morning is. He's doing it to ingratiate himself and make him yeah, like yeah. he's one of us. Yeah, he's stop not. talking shit on Jack. <laughs> You're a hater. Ready to yeah, cry. he's a great guy. I, I am ready to cry. Um, I, I, I'm going to allow oh, myself to. I know I usually act tough in front of Brie. And I can't show my emotions to impress her with my manliness. That doesn't happen. You always say that you buy something from Brian as well, right? But not when it comes to this. He I'm just likes to blame other people for his problems. I'm going to be a wreck by the end of this stream. <laughs> Jake, total the morning, mate. Um, make a magical make it in the house. So Forspoken came out, guys. I don't want to talk about this too much, but... Ah. No, we don't. Got a vid. I'm going to be putting out a vid. Dude, my, my tweet on it, it kind of blew up a little bit. Did. People talking about it. People feel big about this game. Yeah. And it's flopped. Yeah. It's flopped. Mm -hmm. Turned down the drain. <laughs> and I called it. I called the score within 0.2 of accuracy. And people get mad at me for that. Yeah. Yeah, why? Why? I was because right. Because you're a bad winner. <laughs> oh, you're a poor <laughs> winner. <laughs> you know, some people are like very it brings, humble. It brings me no When they joy. win, they're like, Yes, I was right, but I'm not happy about it. Oh, I'm a good guy. And you're like, oh, I was right, I'm never wrong. Not even one of them is a better, and the game was gonna shock, and it fucking shocks, and you were all wrong. Ha <laughs> ha. No, that's see, it. that's 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 so that's such a <laughs> gross exaggeration. Yeah, but you're you're filled bring, with gross exaggeration, so yeah. I'm just trying to go to your level. Yeah, it brings me no joy <laughs> to see Forspoken getting such a low score, <laughs> but Mm -hmm. I was right. Yeah, you could think it was great. Yeah. Um, it, it could be a decent game. You can yeah. enjoy it. But it ain't just review bombs, my friends. It simply mm. isn't, man. I, I'll cover this all in the video I'm going to put out later. People are going to roast me for this one. Yeah. Roast me. Yeah. And it's the same as for blockchain gaming. I'm just talking about the reality of it. Like, that's what I don't get with these videos. I'm saying, like, it could be good, it could not. I've not played it. Here's my opinion. Here's my bias. Here's my POV. But then I'm just stating the fucking reality of it. This is the reality of blockchain gaming. Square are going into it. They are putting 50 mil into it. Forspoken did get a 3.6. I'm just stating the reality, and people are like, eh, eh, eh. It's like, bro, it's happened, okay? Yeah. This is where we're at. You can disagree with it, and you can hate it, mm. and you can think it's unfair. But Forspoken is bombed. Yeah. I mean, when we don't know it's bombed yet, it depends what its game sales are going to be. Yeah. And did you, what, what guys, do you think time. the scores, how many copies do you think it's going to sell? June was telling me that people did a poll and some people think it's going to be sub one mil. Sub one mil. I don't think that's, I, I think it will sell more than that because already on Steam, it's got more sales and, or more pre sales than the Harry Potter game. So. Mm. On the Steam pre-sale. Well, Spoker's got more pre-sales. So. Really? Wow. wow, that is surprising. Wow. Well, people keep that. Is, is that just because Harry mm. Potter's getting boycotted like crazy? or? That could be a part of I, it. I, I, I don't think it's getting boycotted as... That. Harry Potter must be... I don't think it's getting boycotted as much as it's just there's a big conversation around it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, 
where people are just trying to be aware of the situation. Yeah. But I feel like the general consensus is it's not the developer's fault. Yeah. It's not the people who worked on it's fault. Mm -hmm. So don't boycott it. What, I that J.K. Rowling has some pretty... Dicey, she's, dicey stuff she, in her. She's, she's a shithead, for sure, but <laughs> at the end of the day, she already Ed. made... I was watching his son, and he made a great point on it. Yeah. She already made her money. You're not gonna... You're not gonna hurt her. You're not, like, Harry Potter is already a thing. It's, like, ascended above her, so it's like... It has, but, but that's the thing. It's got such a huge fan base. I am mm. shocked to hear forspoken has got more pre-sales than that. Ari freaking pooper. I mean, how far? Yeah, so it's, it's a while away, right? Okay. Yeah, that, you can't really compare them then with that. I mean, when is Harry Potter coming out? I think it's March time. March. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's a fair. It bit looks of really good. But anyway, there's Forspoken. You're gonna see it in the upcoming vid. Forspoken is the fifth highest rated game of the year. Out of five. Out of five. Yeah. <laughs> what was number one again? Monster Hunter, wasn't it? Yeah. Wait, yeah, what? Monster Hunter Rise Monster is number one. There's a new Monster Hunter? There's a new Monster Hunter. Am I, like, even a person anymore? I know. Is it, is it, is I don't know anything that's That's happening. the thing in Asia, you get a... Uh... I don't think Monster Hunter... I don't think Monster Hunter... The new Monster Hunter... You already had one. It's not on Xbox or PS5, though, it's so anything. I've had, two, uh, I've had, two, I've had two coffees. You've had two? I've had yeah. two. I'm buzzing. Might go Already? For, both uh, of you. Yeah, we're both. You're both fucking nuts. You've got a Minerva fight to take oh, on. Oh, Jesus. You've got to be pumped. Yeah, I need to catch up. So why are you taking sips of my I coffee, then? I don't know. I do like to drink other people's drinks. I yeah. do. I love drinking other people's mm. be beverages. Such a little Is anyone else boy. the same? Like, you're walking around, and if somebody has, like, a glass of water or juice in the house, you're just like, oh, I'll have some <laughs> of that. Oh, I, Monster Hunter's been out for, like, a year now, and I still didn't know about it. It's good. Am I so, 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 what, so is it only just come out on PS5? Is that the gig? I don't think it's out on PS5, is it? Yeah, because uh, that, that's where I saw Monster Hunter Rise. It was out of the five PS5 games that have been released in 23. Hmm. Well, I guess I'm just not paying attention to anything over it. Yeah. It's PC exclusive. Minerva! Minerva! <laughs> How hard is she gonna realistically be? She's gonna be easy. Minerva gonna get slapped. I'm gonna slap Minerva into the ground. Okay. <laughs> you say so. Right. <laughs> You're doing that face again. Okay. Yeah, that's yeah. the face of doubt. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you gotta accept that. It doesn't inspire confidence. Okay, but it doesn't only apply to you. Oh, maybe I'll get slapped. But I'm going to try it on <laughs> hard mode. Anyway, anything else in the news, guys? Anything happening in your lives? Want to ask Brie, Auntie Brie, anything before we um, begin? My my sweater says, what's up, Grinches? What's up, Grinches? What's up, Grinches? Yeah. Merry Christmas. Brie is a walking meme. That's why I like her. She's she's the closest thing to a the embodiment of a living meme. Yeah. An internet frog. All of her clothing is meme-y. And your hair colour's a meme. A meme? You're just a walking meme, and I love it. <laughs> it doesn't sound so nice, but then you follow it with I love it, so I, I don't know what to think. <laughs> ah. Strangers in the news this morning when I clicked. Yeah? Final Fantasy, Strangers of Paradise. Oh, yeah, maybe Strangers of Paradise is getting a sequel, yo. Oh. Cool. But again... Square Enix keep doing this, depending oh, on such popularity. Dicks. That's not that's not true. Depending on popularity, they're, that, they're, that means they're already doing it. They're already doing they it. They just want you to buy their shit. Yeah. yeah, we've learned this. If you don't buy it, we won't do mm. it. But then, when you do, even if it doesn't get the game sales, ah, oh, well, we're just gonna do it what anyway. What would you want from a second Stranger's game, right? Like, because mm. we've got the obviously the new. I think I mean, got, it's got so yeah, much yeah. DLC in it anyway. Yeah. Would you want it to turn to like three and four or something like that? That sort of territory, like a bit more. I don't know. I don't know. It's Would Jack come back. Like, it's strange. I don't know how a sequel back. would Jack. operate. I don't even think it's necessary, but yeah. Hey, anyway, we'll see. If we beat it today and I cry, yeah. don't think of me as less of a man. I won't. <laughs> you always be top tier man in my eyes. Because it's really hard for me to watch what happens to Zach and then. Cloud. No, no spoilers. Cloud. No spoilers. Because remember, dude, 
I might like this Cloud's voice. That I mean, he might be the only voice actor that I like genuinely like more than the OG. Not to hate on the OG voice actor, he was great, but uh -huh. this guy just be like. He's the only one that's a standout where I'm like, yeah. that was way more powerful than the OG. Yeah. Yeah. Like well, his well, little well, scream he does, it's like, well, holy, well, you really put your whole heart into that, bro. Yeah, we're gonna hear that scream Ugh. in a row. And that's moment. that's gonna make that's gonna make me feel a thing. Mm hmm Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm ready, man. <laughs> Not ready. <laughs> You're gonna induce some Wow, tears, what a little faker. All right. Should we dive in? Let's yeah. do this. 10 4. Oh, my, Ay, caramba. My heart is kabooming. It could be the coffee, mm. or it could be the anticipation of what we're about to go. It's the coffee. <laughs> it's the coffee for sure. But we're in Gongaga. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, Gongaga. I swear, if the screen keeps going black, I hate it. I'm going to punch the TV so hard it explodes. Oh man, I hope Gongaga is spicy in the remake. It's it, cool. it was yeah, such, it's really pretty. It was I don't such a nothing being burger. Pretty. You know what? I would say it's a bit of a slug shit out. What do you think they're going to do with Gongaga in the remake, guys? What will happen in that section? Something big, I hope. Something huge. We're going to punch Zach's parents. <laughs> shit. Behind yeah. you. So predictable. Couldn't you guess your hometown would be the first place we'd look? Yeah, come on, Zach. <laughs> Stop being an Silly idiot. boy. Here to see your parents? Yeah, so? What's wrong with that? You're so a fugitive on the run, Zach. <laughs> That's, That's what's, what's wrong. wrong with that. <laughs> Silly boy. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess you're right. It was pretty careless. Ooh. I like the way it sounds. We'll be going. It's little. And you know, a little bit like Zach's delivery there. Security is very tight right now. Rick Gomez isn't Apparently. too bad in some areas. Is Rick Gomez area. is the original. Uh, Crispin. Crispin. F is it Crispin? Angie. The new guy. I don't know the new guy's name. Yeah, sorry. Rick Gomez is original. But like, the new guy is new guy until further I notice. I think it's Crispin. By your hand. Crispy? <laughs> You're not surprised. Crispin. I think he may have helped Crispin. Us. Escape Shinra Manor. Oh, one of my headphones is still dead, man. Uh -huh. Why do you want to cut me off anyway? He came here to see you. The latter section of Quest Score is looking so much better. Oh, it looks way better. The first part. The Turks are watching. I'll give you ten minutes. After that. Why is it Angel? Why Angel's dead? What's his name? I'm not in the mood. I can't bring bad news to your Caleb parents. Caleb Pierce. Caleb Pierce, not Crispin. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were so off. <laughs> Close enough. Crispin. Close oh, enough. She's worried. You know. She thinks mm. after all this, mm. you'll never be able to find someone to marry. Good to see you, mate. Mm. Jazzy's in the What's house. What's up with that? They're nice yeah. people. Mm. They're doing fine. Where did Cisne get this mad connection know. with Zach from exactly? Just yeah. happened. Uh, yeah, they they did kind of just shove that in your face. Yeah, it just That's happened. There was no kind of development mm -hmm. or like becoming homies. Raised inside Chinra. Maybe she just likes the cut of Zach's jib. Zach is a likable well, is person. He, is she, yeah, is it because he's, he's likable? I mean, if I met someone like would Zach, I would want to be his friend. Keeping my folks company for so. a while? Is it because Zach is kind of breaking right. out of... No problem. Breaking out of the status quo and no Cisne idealizes freedom as well for herself? Already I don't know, mister. Or what did you say? Did she just see Zach's bulge Sister. and she's like, mm. my real name. She did see his abs. You have five minutes left. Cisne is not her real name. Do we have to actually find out? Oh, Angel? I don't know. Angel, it is you. Or is it just? <sighs> it's not Angel. Somebody did a flappy ginger. What's that? There's hey, a wait. There's a white winged flapper. Yeah. White winged flapper. A white winged flapper. They have like white hair as well. Yeah. And like sort of a. I wonder who that was. Mm -hmm. Ginger. Is it really Angel? Mm -hmm. No, there's one way to know. 
Do you think that was... Did you see what he was wearing? It was like a suit. Yeah, it's not Aunt Jill. Yeah. An old tweed suit. You look nothing like Aunt Jill. New search department in QMC obtained. A new shop is available. We got a new shop. A new shop? Oh, that's pretty good. All right, we, we, uh... Fun fact. A reactor blew up in Gungaga. Did it? That's why it looks so fucky-wucky. Mm. That's why there's all of those... So did they rebuild Gungaga as well? Or no, because it, it was a explode? reactor explosion. That's why Gungaga looks so fucky-wucky all the time. Ah, this TV's getting so bad. Should I punch it and see oh, if it fixes it? Let's see in remote. Activating combat mode. Oh, Ooh. there's a griffin. Griffin! Are we still on the hard? I don't know. We're so strong at this point. Strong. Oh my god, that was reduced. Mind and body. Acting together is one. Everyone guess this man's real name. Oh yeah. His name's real name. Do we actually know what it is, or I guess we'll never know. Who cares? Let's just fight these oh, monsters and no, get this don't. over with. <laughs> oh my god, everything's so squishy. We've got two powerful Bree. Oh, yeah. We're just... probably on normal, babe. Alright. Isn't her real name whatever you named her in before? Oh, we're on hard. She's the MC. Hmm. Is she the uh... MC? She's not the MC of Before Crisis, isn't that shotgun? Huh. There's a character sure, called. Sure. Shotgun, yeah. So, so they they name them like knives, <laughs> two, two guns. Um, they just sort of named after weapons. That's not their real name, though. Oh, no. um, said set the TV to W for Womble. <laughs> that might fix it. You're probably right, bro. Oh yeah. W for Womble. Where am I going? I'm going this way, Bree. Yes. That's how I'm going. Yes. Where are you going? I'm staying right here. <laughs> DLC details for Go Theatre under the waterfall. For Theatre River, the new final oh. line. Wait, you're saying the DLC? Season 1 DLC details have been put out for it. Oh, we can Go under the waterfall. Go on. So there's only 167 new songs. On top of the. On top of the 382 building. Whoa! I thought there was something there. Are you guys looking forward to Final Bar Line? I'm so excited for this one. Melody of Memories, I think that was the Kingdom Hearts one. We had a blast on that, man. Yeah. Played some of you guys online. I don't think that I played Melody of Memory. I can't remember. They do, do, does it have an online feature? Final Bar Line. Yeah. Yeah. You Any of you guys want to take me on to Final Bar Line? Yeah. 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 I think it's just a setup we've got going because it wouldn't run without that screen in it. So, all right. Well, I think it's just feeling. <clears throat> oh, is is the person? Hey, it's a man. He has legs. Da, 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 da. Not leg. Why do we have any material junction in our? Ooh. Go, 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 go. We've got a G blader. Why now? Why now? A G. Blader so, G. Get what's your Sorry, hair, my boy? Spit in my mouth. G. The G better. He's, he's getting predatorial. Hey! Oh, little strum. Good night, sweet Brie. Shut up. I'm trying to focus. <laughs> Let go of me. Never. Let go of me. Oh, why does my back hurt? It does it. Oh, that hurts pretty bad, actually. <laughs> I'm in pain. Oh, I'm gonna die. Run away. You're in for it now. Danny. Hello. Up, Danny. Good to see down. ya. Pick to six yeah. is raving with a party of 7,000 people. 7,000? 7,000. What about six to six? Right. Hello, oh, guys. Good morning. Ah. Oh. <laughs> I could not eat it. Where have you come from, guys? Right in my butt. Yeah. Yeah, boys, come. Well, let's get some thrusting going in there. How's it going, mm -hmm. mate? It's going good, bro. What have you been up to? <laughs> 
Have you just come from a merc bank? How's it going, mate? Dream. It was a big spot. I know it's early, but. What are they? But don't take it to you and don't look at oh. them. Look at what flavour they are. Oh, shrimpies. No, oh, no, 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 no damn shrimpies. Look at what flavour they are, but they're good. You can't, yeah. you can't sneak things on yeah, people. Yeah, yeah, playing some Forspoken is sneaky. weird. Yeah. But for, dude, you're doing Forspoken. <laughs> Started the stream to chat him a lot about oh. that. Uh, I'm not going to go back down that channel yeah, just yet. There's a video yeah. coming later. Hmm. Taking you can down get pissy at me then. Ah, oh, biffed it, Brie on the chan. Biff. Should have done Master Raga Blade. Don't know why I didn't. Yeah, Maybe. I think you're not paying... Because that's how I just died. I stopped paying attention. So. Just focus. Well, you got it. You focus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just focus. <laughs> Good to see you, man. Oh, yeah. How long I'll stay awake, but we'll see. All right, we'll rush to the ending for Andy. Yeah. We'll zoom this. Stay awake, Andy. Ooh. Three, three, Press the button. Try to have a third coffee. Yeah. Press the button. Not yet, Brianna. Press the button. I know you, you spam it. Press the button. It's not about no. spamming it. You gotta do it while you have it available. What the because then if something else comes up it and the just drain oh. explode it. Oh, it now. If you big five up. If you You lose it, but you don't have to hit it straight away. You yeah, hit you it do. Look, No you don't. Yeah, but why wouldn't you? Because you I didn't need it at that point. Do you know what Lucky Stars does? Lucky Stars ups your uh, DMW and shit. So why did you do you think that you don't need it? Because I want to. I wanted to use it as an invincibility frame. Because you can use DMWs as an inv invincibility frame. I think you, you don't understand you, how we're. You understand an invincibility on. frame? You got attack coming. Do you understand that you're wasting things? Actually, not. You're not, you're not wasting it if you're still going to use it. But you don't have to pop it the second it comes up. I think it's a good idea. To no, it's too new. I've seen you pop air. I've seen you. I've seen you pop air with healing wave, max HP, come out, get booty slapped with no mana and die. I've, I've seen you lose. Oh god, I swear. Air gives you Jesus, that's Dude, that, that was a black screen. That wasn't on Brie. That was a black screen work. That's so annoying. Let her go again. The TV's cutting you in. You're right the TV. Have you got an issue? I might see if there's anything oh. I can do. Yeah. Yeah, it's just going. Look at it. It's in and out, in and out. That's how they're meant how to annoying. work. I, I disagree. You're not meant to spam them because because the DMW system it gives you like what ten seconds until you can <laughs> cast it. You don't have to cast it straight away. Yeah, but there's. I've wait. seen you miss out on them several times. Where I missed you... out on it like once. Or no, twice. because you're not paying attention. That's a lie. It's not a lie. That's a straight lie. I can it's guarantee. Not a lie. I can guarantee. Go back. I'll go back, back to the. Go pitch. back. Go back through the whole stream because right. you missed out on them. We're a few supposed times. to be here for the ending, and we're gonna have a domestic. This... Are you threatening me? Ah. A domestic? <laughs> you crazy? We're having a falling out this morning. A falling out? Why? Because <laughs> cause you got called out. No! Again. Yeah. No! Okay, let's see if it works this time. Uh, you really just threatened to hit me on stream. A domestic isn't violence. Having a domestic it can also be a verbal... Yeah, what does domestic mean to you? <laughs> if, you get, if you get a domestic situation, but what she, does it mean to you? She's not domestically she abusing me right now. She's just doing it verbally. <laughs> Verbally, why? Because I told you you waste your DMW. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You just don't like being told when you're wrong because I'm a fantasy happened? peasant and I'm never wrong and it's domestic what abuse to say otherwise. What happened? <laughs> what the fuck happened to don't backseat game me? When I when I when I give you advice in the combat. Cause... Yeah, that's what you just did. Do you understand that you're you're being a hypocrite? Because no. just now you told me, oh, you use them too, you use them too often. No. You use them too no. often. No, because you were, I was playing it, and you uh -huh. were, you were jumping in on what I should do on my play. Yeah. And you were saying I needed to use my. And lucky you say stars. you don't do that to me. Yeah. Oh, you oh, you use it already. Why'd you use it already? Yeah. Shut up, you hypocrite. But the point being <laughs> is when I tell you stuff. You're just trying to fight. <laughs> Stop trying to fight. Shh. We're in this together. Okay? I know we are. Uh, it's come okay. on. We both do it. Can we agree we both do it? There we go. Yes, pal. Communication. Mm, 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 oh, mm, ah, mm, that kind of hurt. Mm. I haven't even got any rings on. Yeah, but you have really, like, meaty knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> Big, meaty claws. Hoofs. 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 
Dude, the screen is cutting out even more. What have you changed in the settings? It's even worse now. Da, da, da. Because there's a game mode option, but apparently it's shite. Changes ruin the TV even more. Hmm. Well, it's shite anyway. Yeah, what we're doing right now is waiting for... The, the screen keeps going black. <laughs> And screwing us. This is like trying a, to fix it. This is like a mini domestic. Love it. They're actually really nice. Oh, I'll try some of your smelly shrimp crisps. They're not shrimp crisps. They're gyoza flavored. Oh, actually, they do yeah. smell quite yeah. delicious. Yeah. Make love, not war. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you guys want to see that. Oh, they would. Is it good? Mm. Yeah, Can you feed it to me? Mm. I don't want stinky yeah. fingers. Have one of my ratchety oh. finger crisps. Mmm. Yeah. Right. That's fucking good. Gyoza flavored crisps. This That's is, yummy. This now is a new gyoza. innovation. Now I want Wow. Yum, yum. Mm. Pez sometimes needs a backseat gamer because some of the stuff he does is holy shit, this is making me go insane. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Well, I still don't think that's a good enough... Because that's the thing. It's different if you're in person. But sometimes backseat gaming can be pretty. Sometimes it's hard to, to hold yourself back from doing, which is why we both do it to each other. But to a degree, like you can't go too hard with it because it's fucking annoying and distracting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let people make their own mistakes for the most part. But if they keep making it over and over and over and over again, then that's, that's a different thing, right? But what people consider a mistake for me mm. is I intentionally reduce my ex... I mean, for example, let's go to the remake. Let's go to the remake. It was too easy. It actually was. Right. It was too easy, so I, I stopped using healing. I took all magic and all potions off. In the remake? Yeah, in the opening section. It you was look, pretty easy at first, Oh, yeah. mate, what are you doing? You need to use heal. You need mm. to use heal. And it's like, I, I was dying and I was wiping, mm. but I was having fun mm. with the challenge. Mm. And the people see you die and they're like, He's died, right? There's a problem, right? Everyone, quick, chip in, chip in. This is what you need to do. This is what you're doing mm. wrong. It's like dying in a game isn't the worst thing in the world. It's true. You know what I hated most about 15? I only died twice, and both of them was crashing the regalia. Yeah, dying in 15, <laughs> I don't remember if I even did die. I think I died once. I think I died once. Pez is lying. Let's go, Ellen. Pez is lying. Me and you, right now. Lying about what? Shirt, shirts off. Bare knuckle. Oh, you're getting. In the mud. You're getting. <laughs> we watched this show. What's it called? A hundred. A hundred. It's just called a hundred. Has anyone Netflix. seen it on Netflix? It's like all these Korean. Um, like bodybuilders. Bodybuilders, dancers, firemen, calisthenics, mountain rescue, military. Just dudes. like the strongest of the strongest of the country. To see what is the best physique. And they just fuck each other up. They like one of them like he like yeeted the other guy in the jaw. Oh yeah, well Ooh. one of the uh, exercises was rough. Whoever's holding a ball at the end of three minutes, man, they're slamming each other's oh. heads. Like there was I was this, worried somebody was gonna get a concussion. There was this uh, he's something like nine nine times champion bodybuilder in Korea nine years in a row. Yeah, going up against Agent Hate. Mm. Agent H, Agent yeah. Agent H, like this, like tough. He's, a, he's got like a killer look in his eye. Yeah, he was, he was a, in the military, he was a sniper. Me and Bree were laying in bed, <laughs> eating cake, watching them. I had kicky feet so bad. I was like, get him, get him, get his ass. It was yeah. too much. It was so intense. So we were watching like these people who are like the, uh, the creme de la creme of physical <laughs> fitness going in, and we're just in bed. Eating cake. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Panicking. Freaking out. I, my heart rate was so through the roof by the time that episode was over, and I was like, shit, we gotta go to bed now, and I'm so up. <laughs> like, I felt like I was... I felt like I was wrestling in the mud. I'm honestly. up here. I'm up here. I don't want to be here, so let's bring it down here. Five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, we did deep breaths. <laughs> we did. We were like, let's do some deep breaths. Buy okay, a new TV. Down. They don't own the TV. Yeah, we're still in Asia. Yeah. And we've only got... Shit, guys, we've only got five days left. Yeah. Five days left until the sixth. And, and then we're like... going to the UK. It's going to be my first time in the UK. And I'm really excited. She's going to meet my doggy. Yeah. Going to go for walks around orchards. Very exciting. And I'm going to try to teach Brie how to cold plunge. Oh, Uncle okay. Novus, anyone who ever does like cold. Do any of you guys do cold exposures, cold showers, cold plunging? I'm scared. Tell us about your experience because... We, we kind of think about maybe going on a cycling 
We're not camping. thinking about it. We're planning to do it. I keep saying thinking it. And he always does this where he's like, he like doesn't want to, I don't know why you do it, but, but you'll, you'll be like, if we do this or when, like, we maybe do this. Yeah. He doesn't like put anything solidified. Just, just because if, you know, a bike packing trip is, Yeah. I, I don't want to put the expectation on because I don't want the other person to feel like they gotta do it. So I, I want people to arrive at doing things that they want. Well, yeah, I said I wanted to do it, so it's like. Yeah, it's just that obviously if we go on a bike packing trip. I can obviously bow out whenever I want, right? Just yeah. because I said I, I yeah. wanna do it doesn't mean I can't be like, oh, I don't feel like yeah. it anymore, right? But the main deal is it's still kind of cold in the UK and yeah. there's gonna be times you have to bathe in rivers mm. and lakes because this is being out in the wild, being mm. in nature. And that shit get cold, man. So you gotta learn how to uh, Wim Hof to, uh, to breathe. I am nervous about it because I hate the cold. Mm -hmm. I hate it, but I understand the importance of getting used to it. And so it's, I'm gonna so, suck it's it so up. good for you, man. It's so good for you. So yeah, the the it's teeth. actually worse. Like I don't know. What have you changed? Well, I haven't changed. It's all gone back to what it was now. It's literally just being shit. Basically, we're getting a black screen, guys. Should I punch it? Every, like, three, four seconds. Yeah, which is why I died just now. Well, was it just now? It's not going to be anything to do with that. Oh. No, it's I mean, it's, it's, it's totally wrecked. It's not playable at this point, so... Jesus. I mean, what what is this cable? Can we, can we change over some of these? That's my cable. Technical difficulties. Can I take Are this you? out and replug it in? Oh, and as well. What, have you tried I've it on? two different ports, yeah. It's you tried it on the other port? Yeah. It's brass over here at the minute. What does that mean? Brass. It's oh, it's, brass. It's cold. Brass. Mm. Mm. Brass tacks. Brass top. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because uh, follow what the nervous <laughs> system says. Yeah, I was, uh, I played I play, play a little uh, Wim Hof video yesterday. The science. The science of it. Uh, Gets into your nervous system, mm. the stem of your brain. Yeah. It definitely looks cool. Did you break another TV, Pez? Danny, that's cruel. It's not his fault. It's looking broken, my friends. But the t no, it's not the TV, it's because kind of the TV works. It's, it's, the, it's the setup we've got. Something's run. fucked. Oh, you gotta just go for it. You gotta go gonna for it and see if. Uh, See if fighting this guy makes the TV be like, yeah. Guys, we didn't break the TV. The TV's fine. Stop oh. saying that. I think we have broken it. No, we didn't break the TV because the TV works whenever we're doing literally anything else. Nice. Oh. Just pause whenever this happens. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Like, if, if the TV goes black, just pause. It's just an extra layer of challenge. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. This is actually making me want to puke. Puke and shit and puke. Um, sector six, is it snowy? Because that's one of the things that I'm looking forward to. Oh, it's so. potential for snow. So. Because I missed out on snow being in Asia. Snow in March isn't so common. Mm. But we're going to. Oh, we're going to set. Yeah, yeah, there's a potential. There's a potential? Yeah, there's a good potential. <laughs> but we're um, going to press lock when the screen goes black, which is happening. LM says it's likely the display output on the PS5 Zach, itself is incorrect. Right. Yeah. Uh, Who's because we've got the screen behind? It's because we've got the screen running through. Because um, we can't run it straight through from the Yeah, TV. but it was um, so bad now. Oh my god, now I've got murdered. Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys, Ooh, I don't know what's happened, be. but we've oh, been here a month and it's not. Yeah. It's not been like this. Wait, it, it hasn't been this bad. It's been doing it on and on, but not this bad. It's sort of like the last not three, four days. Three, yeah. it's, been, mm -hmm. it's been nuts. Oh, yes. Nice. I've got him good, dude. I've got him real good. I believe in you. So, um, yeah, Wolf's Wolf, real nice. Oh, man, no. God. Genesis. East Coast US, right, Brie? Yeah, um, I'm from Pennsylvania. Apparently they, they have had a good bit of snow. Um so yeah. 
how old is the TV? Now the TV's new. It's like Every, a really everything nice in this house TV. Is brand new. <laughs> Very nice TV. Oh my god, it's cutting out. Ooh. It's cutting out every half a second now. It's like flash, flash. It's really flash, bad. Flash. How are you enjoying the holiday, Bree? Uh, I, I'm really enjoying it a lot. It's, yeah. it's very nice. I like uh, the sounds of the birds. They make, they go, ooh, ooh. Oh, yeah. Ooh, they're very sassy out here. Yeah, they're very sassy. Ooh, ooh. His ooh, cells ooh. are completely <laughs> useless. Cells. Who's Axe? Look who showed up. You oh, shit. Looking all in dirt. He's got Your a black wing. He's a tiny wing. Already <laughs> yeah. Just a little weenie, weenie Paul wing. Leader. You did it. Weenie weenie. To yourself? Yes. After nearly being killed Are they really going to keep saying S cells in my ear hole? Yeah, I guess really so. all I could do to survive. I merely borrow some cells from Genesis. You know you're degrading. Any solution, or we're gonna have to uh, we're gonna have to end the stream at the end of the day, dude. Do the, I think it's just to do with the cable connection between this. All right, there's nothing we can do to switch over. I don't want to end the the game I, like this. I, I don't I don't want to end the stream either. I. Yeah, I, I don't want to end the stream, but I also don't want to finish the game with it. With like, this, yeah. Because I'm not going to enjoy it's it. It's going to ruin it. It's actually killing my eyes. Um, it's not playable. It's not playable. I'm not sure. But I guess we're going to have to cancel. If I want to mess around with the cables, we're going to have to just end the stream for a bit and come back. Why? Yeah. Because I'm going to have to unplug stuff. and So. Unless you just want to keep it on the... Um, the gift of Thanks, the chat, goddess. Well, I mean, we could just talk and see. <laughs> sample will stop, stop the degradation. degradation. Process. Pure. Oh, great, Rick! Thank there you. How oh, kind. Uh, is it you, mate? No. Very nice, very kind. Is it you? Is a former soldier you are a legend, mate. The legend. Thank you, great, Rick. That infantryman. Carries uh, within his body the last. Because it, it doesn't matter. We can restart this section. Yeah. Hey. Do you know the uh, verse in Act Four that leads into? It, it, tr it truly is. It's true. Yeah, we can't even it. watch it right it's now. It's ruining it. Like this is a cool section of the game that's actually really yeah. interesting. I, I can't even get engaged with it. Yeah. What Holland is talking about. Yeah. Um, it's ass. It's big time ass. He's got a question. Um, Do you want to put you on full camp for a bit so you can talk while I'm asking? Yeah. No end it. Yeah, we should, should we just, just scat and hang, guys? Yeah. It, it sucks. Let's do that. But what can you do? What can you do? Can you, do? you get screwed. This happens. This happens. These things happen. <laughs> um, she asked a question. Uncle Nova, are you still in the house? I, I sent you an email back yesterday about sort of the new vision for the channel, the new one I me and Bri are going to make. We can't do this, Bree. Yeah, we're gonna do it. We can't do this. We're we're doing it. Will any of you guys follow Jake and Bree? If you don't, don't be a hater. <laughs> <laughs> it should be fairly simple to resolve. Well, Jin's just gonna try some um, stuff. But what's up, boy? Great. Great reacts got a question. Hey, oh, I've been busy all week, but here is the weekly tenor. Great react is like a nan or a really cool aunt. Gives you your weekly pocket pocket allowance. Aww. Very cute. How sweet. I'm going to go and spend it on sweeties. And by sweeties, I mean weed. <laughs> You're probably me. Well, with weed. Anyways. Uh, you are allowed to return to one FF world in a new game. What is your choice, excluding seven or ten? Eight. Wait, to one FF world in a new game. Oh, I'm so confused. Oh, wait, no, no, no. So it's it's a different story, but the same world. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, I'm so confused oh. about the question. You're allowed to return to one FF world. Oh, in a new in game. In a new game. Yeah, so yeah. it's like a new thing. Um, um, so like, if the 35th anniversary is real. Um, nine. Obviously, 10-3 would be a return to Spira. He says without oh, seven or ten. Excluding seven or ten. Read the question, I mister. No, I forgot. Um, I obviously, think maybe eight would be cool. I, I've always had the see, thought where, of where, like where seeing a game in like Artemisia's world. Artemisia's world? What, in the future before she comes back? 
I think that would be a cool. See, I think like, they you, could, you can do a lot of stuff with that. I think there's a cool prequel story in eight with uh, you know Hein, the skeleton mm. wizard that made the sorceresses. Mm. He tricked humanity. Humanity hated him for it. Mm. He said, "I'll gift you." Uh, part of my magic, then he mm. gifted them his uh, flesh, which was non-magical. Apparently his bones mm. were the magical part, and he buggered off, and humans were like... Typical man, offering a gift of his flesh. <laughs> <laughs> and then it ended up being a trick. Tricksy. So, um, yeah, so I mean, there's a little bit of saying eight there. The 35th anniversary is saying we're getting a new tactics game, yo. Ooh. Turning to the tactics world. We love tactics Sweet. here. But the answer is easy for me and Brian, Brian and myself last night. It was so cool. She looked at me and she was like, Jay, what fun fantasy should we play together? Yeah. Because we were sat listening to music mm. and we were both vibing, feeling it. And we were like, we haven't actually connected properly over. Mm. A fun fancy. We were gonna play 10 together and we started, but then he started streaming it, so obviously we're not gonna play it. I'm saying, I know we're playing Crisis School, but it doesn't feel like a fun, proper fun fantasy, is it? Crisis School is a yeah. proper fun fantasy. Yeah, like I'm, we wanna play a main, not a main one, but like, you know what I mean? My head went straight to Type Zero, and Brie was like, what about Type Zero? We had yeah. a little, yeah. little yeah. mental zoop. Mm -hmm, zoop, mm -hmm. zoop. <laughs> and to be honest, that's probably my answer. Type next, man, mm. or something in Fablin over Crystallis universe. I actually love FNC. Yeah. Hot take. Hot take. Do any of you guys love it, FNC, or mm. would you take it or would you leave it? I just feel like oh. Lindsay needs to have his bum slapped. Or her. I don't know if Lindsay is a chick or a dude. Um, mm -mm. Nine, just to hug Vivi. Word. I want to see six, returning ruin to balance. Yeah? For me, I'd love to go to Van... Six would be cool, yeah. Van Adiel. Six, six, six. Oh, my God. <laughs> LM. I want... Jelly and Brie. I want drugs. <laughs> I actually like that a little bit. I will follow Jelly and Brie. Okay, well, I was... But Brie spelled like the cheese. <laughs> But why am I... Why, how does that mean I'm jelly? He's going to take that as an insult. Yeah, that means I'm fat. Who wants to be called... But Jelly is sweet. Who wants to be called want to Jelly? Be oh, hi, I'm Jelly. That's actually kind of a cute name. I might as well call myself Flub. Hello, I'm Flub. No, but Jelly sounds cute. I, I'm Gloop. <laughs> jelly sounds cute. Six is good, nine is good. Yeah. Flan. Hello, I'm Flan. Bon Flan. Fantasy Flan. Hmm. <clears throat> I know we have a play on the green and brown thing. Or something... Uh... But I'm not going to have green hair forever, let's be real. Like, I'm going to have green hair for a long time. You probably will. And green is my favorite color, but there's going to come a time where I'm going to want to be brown again. Yeah? Yeah. Or what if I want to go purple? Oh. I don't want to lock myself into a hair color. <clears throat> mm. You know? We're saying that. I don't, we still haven't looked. I kind of want to get a tattoo before we leave it in the next five days. Any ideas, guys, for a tat? In fact... Second or third suggestion for Tao, I'll just do it. Yeah, let's not do that. Yeah. Let's not do that. That's that's kind of insane. But someone within the 36 people watching the stream right now is going to decide my next tap. Um, excuse me, people. On your top break. I see that there's 34 of you in here and only 10 of you liked it. That's kind of mean. You can't. They, they want... They're not going to like a stream where the game that they've been advertised isn't playing. No. Like been, it, like it to. They've been lied to. No, 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 no. They've been lied. No, Let, the reason why it's screwing up is because they haven't liked it. So you have to gaslight them mm. and turn it back onto them. Mm. Yeah, mm. it's the tech. It's Gas, the tech. Gaslighting. How could yeah. you do this to us? <laughs> <laughs> How could you do it? It's all your fault. Why would you do it? Hi. Le C brand to connect to your love of F and C. See, Le C brand mm -hmm. is just too common. It's too, mm. At one point in my life, I was going to get the C brand, and then I saw how many people were doing it, and I was mm. like, mm. I want my tats to be unique. Mm. Unique. You're one of those girls, huh? What kind of girl are you talking about, Novus? Alt girl. Alt girl? What does that even mean? Alter alternate. Alternative? Is that what he means? I don't know. Uh. Whenever I hear alt girl, my, my main impression is just two things. No, three things. Hmm. Strange coloured hair, hmm. likes weird kind of heavy music, hmm. strong low likelihood that she'd lick your bum. Well, I think 
for me, I might lick a bum, but <laughs> no, no, I, I, I've been on this earth for so many years mm -hmm. and I always wanted green hair because I love the color green and I only like recently got the courage to do it like a year ago. So I wouldn't really consider myself just because of my hair color. When you went on you your know? big, big independence art. Oh yeah. I went crazy. Mm -hmm. I was like, I'm going to get all the tattoos I want and I'm going to dye my hair and nobody's going to stop me because I'm finally gonna that's what it was before. It was, yeah. Time. Yeah. I was like, nobody's going to hold me back from doing things I want anymore. You can't tell me what to do. <laughs> it, was, it was like, it was like I had a weird parent, but it was my significant other. Yeah. Very Ch strange. Checking out the Final Fantasy Reddit. Waiting for yeah. the final bar line on 16th of Feb. Be like. Yeah. <laughs> I really can't. Are you good at rhythm games? I can't wait for this game. I depends on the game. Oh. I'm good at uh, Friday Night Funkin'. What do you think about this tattoo, guys? I think that's uh, actually... It's clunky. It's clunky. Oh, tattoos, yes. It's clunky. I, can't I certainly I'm wouldn't get it. I found some new But I don't know. What... Too big. Too big, too. What do you think of this guy's Flopped stat? right in the middle of his. It Tell me like if he this got comes through clearly. <laughs> yeah. Just on the back of the calves, it's uh, Ifrit and Shiva killer. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe over this way a bit? That's it, yeah. Mm -hmm. What do we think of that? That is cool. Them. And I think, I think tats on the back of the calves are strange. Yeah, I think that the location's kind of like me. Yeah. It looks like kind of like you got. Punched. But that sort of spherical pattern shape. No, I've had an idea for a type zero tat like that. Mm. But where, where can you put anything that's large and circular on your body? That's kind of one of those things where, but you would have to put things around it for it to not look fucking weird. There's loads of tattoos that seem much alike, but they'd have to be back tattoos. And yeah. The first tattoo of not having a back tattoo done. Yeah. Or a chest tattoo as well. Like. I kind of, you know, I said I want a fox on here. I don't know if I want to try to. Do you think I could get a merge between a, a, a regular fox, but then it also has a little bit of a, a Sheba look in it, but then also has a little bit of red 13. Oh, so is this fixed? Oh, I'm just giving it a few more seconds huh. to see if it does it. But oh, it seems like it's fixed. Oh, hmm. man. Is it fixed? Because hmm. we've already started waffling. I feel yeah. like we've lost the room. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, anyone who's watched the stream up to this point, they've probably bounced out on Full Fancy no. Peasant. Because we, we said we weren't doing it. It looks like it's... Yeah, I think it's better. What did you do? Swaps over to another cable in the back. Mm. That's my idea, Ginge. No, because I didn't realize we had another cable. Damn it, Gingy. <laughs> right, I think, I think we've actually got it fixed. Nice one, mate. Yeah, I didn't realize we had that for cable stuff. So. Pay rise for Ginge. Yeah, like like the video for Jin yeah. for fixing yeah, everything yeah. for us. Now, um, now where's my thing? All right, I'm just going to shake it's working on. <sighs> oh, wait a second. Thank no goodness. Big <clears throat> good? Yeah. So, uh, Genesis nearly killed Hollander, and mm. Hollander had to G-sell himself to survive. Mm. And now he's got a weenie black wing. Weenie wing. And there's a bunch of... Creatures that are obsessed, they want e they want pure S cells, right? Yeah. Because S cells are stable. Yes. So mm. Come on. this is one theory that Genesis has on what the gift of the goddess is, a stable pure S cell. Yeah. All right. All right. We back. good? Yeah. You sure? Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Let's go. The final you got to see that right. Thank goodness. Legend Thank you for fixing it. Nice. Of sacrifice. Yay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't like this white counter, bro. Can, the wind can we take it down? Over the water's surface. You always see it. Erase the pass? <laughs> yeah. Sex sure. is Shut the fuck up, bro. Enough about sacrifices and endings. Yeah, he's over I don't it. Hear it. My head. <laughs> I don't want to hear you it. You don't understand the beauty <laughs> of these words. How tragic. How tragic. I'm not surprised. Even I didn't understand all of it. <laughs> the greatest that mystery behind my hair. the gift of the goddess. Go on. The water's surface. Is the answer I have arrived at? Is the live stream? Is the live stream. Uh, Genesis is on my. He's right on that front. What? There are various theories regarding the missing final act. Oh, I do like a good theory. However, <laughs> only my theory is correct. 
and I will prove it to you. I write you, you Genesis. Need to no. clip that and use that it. I know. That's use it in your theory bits. <laughs> Only my theory oh. is correct. <laughs> Definitely use that in your upcoming you bid. <laughs> it's, it's a golden idea right there. <laughs> in danger. See, I have good ideas. I'm not useless. Move quick. Yeah. Praise me. Praise me. <laughs> praise, praise. Thank you. Praise unto ye. Unto ye. <laughs> but now you've got to actually help me come up with some theories. Go on, yeah. Bree. Your craziest, any Final Fantasy game, cra craziest theory. Come up with a theory? Just, just right off, now? Off the top of your head. If you, if you And you too, guys, you too. Does someone come up with a random theory that's never existed before? Off the top of your noodle. Dan is a super saiyan. Who? Lieutenant Dan? Zidane, Zidane, Zidane. He's a super saiyan. World ending ape. Yeah. Ah, oh, don't don't cross collab. That's icky. Why? Fake oh, icky. You said I don't want none of that you Dragon said I Ball. could make oh, you're an, an, or hate them. Don't hate on Dragon Ball. Fantasy. Dragon Ball. At the end of the day, Final Fantasy IX stole the the monkey thing, the boy okay. with the tail thing from Dragon Ball. Let's really? be. Dragon Ball kind of makes it off Journey to the West. The other. Everybody's stealing things. Look yeah. at this. Avery. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, for anyone who hasn't seen my latest vid on the mothers, my theory, Clive, maybe gonna kill a little kid. Maybe gonna kill a little kid. Or well, at least be confronted with killing a kid. <laughs> Would you kill a kid to bring about world peace? Yeah. You Whoa. would? Watch no, out. probably not. I don't know if I have the... Yeah. I don't know if I have the Why balls Why are they trying to that. be cloud? He ain't pure. <laughs> it's, it's freaking Lazard, man. Is it? No, it's Angel's face. But I think it's, oh. it's, it's Lazard's Lazard outfit. It's, yeah, Lazard's outfit on Angel's head. That's it. You. Yeah, it, it, it gets crazy. Hollander was trying to grope Cloud. Hmm. Look at him in his little wing. Oh, is he he's taking some nummies. Over. He needs some more of his head. Oh, look, Hollander's got that floppy body syndrome. He's done zombie body. <laughs> Funny worm. Oh, man, we're too strong. Am I going to wipe Bree? No. No. You got this. Worms. Deadly breath. Oh my I don't God. remember Hollander being too strong. Later. <laughs> I like Hollander's rock. Yeah. Look at he it. looks like a titan. He's so cute. <laughs> he doesn't look like a titan. <laughs> he definitely runs like a titan. Oh, man. oh wow, that actually hits pretty goddamn hard. It's changed in a different room or country. <laughs> no, he's right next to us. Uh, do I have to S you know this nonsense? Yeah. You are not too strong. Word? Get my DMW back. <laughs> oh, jeez, why'd you ruin it? You, 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 oh, they stole my... You do have a rush assault, by the way. I don't know you. Brace yourself! Uh, Prove your honor to me. Oh, 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 oh. I got it. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna have to whack Hollander's head in because he's gonna keep summoning these wormies, isn't he? Mm -hmm. But he won't summon six worms. Huh. Woo! Big damage. Yeah. I thought you were saying your own coin. My own coin, yeah. Look, whenever we start wrestling and popping off, you're yeah. in a safe distance. Yeah. No feet to the face or anything. No. <laughs> I know we're good. I mean, I have that on board of anyway, but it's sometimes. Oh, it's something more fucking worse! It's better to have some distance away from him. Yeah. A safe distance. Easy to get whacked, for sure. What level are we? I think 35? We're pretty low, honestly. Is that are we long? higher? Yeah, it is. Is it? Mm -hmm. That Ooh. deadly breath is some yeah, freaking nonsense. The way that hits. 
away, Hollander! You meaning! He's trying to hit me with his man bag. Man bag. Oh, spin come back again. Here we go. Oh, one of us. Oh, 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 yes. <laughs> Why are you like this? Get in there. You do a few attacks and then you do your high jump. That's how you get the mad crit. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Dimension missile. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How many attacks do you have to get until you can get the crit? Oh, what the? He had that in his man bag? You're he got a bag. Oh! Novus. What the? What just happened? Novus says, you gonna let an old man beat you? <laughs> he is, he, he's not a normal old man. Come on now. No, he's Bring a close. He's on the <laughs> Prove your honor to me. He's he got him jumping missiles in his purse. Yeah. Oh. Kim <laughs> Jong in missiles. Jeez. That's a, that's a bum bag of mass destruction. Bum bag. Ginger, your face is not getting itchy because of the full beard. I can't keep the full beard because the beard's really itchy. Um, it, it seems like that at first. But I wouldn't see guys scratching themselves, though. You guys both did. Oh, I've not had magic pot. You're in for it now. First time I've seen magic pot. Yeah. Ooh, let's see. Oh, oh, have it. Oh, this, oh. oh. Um, where'd you pull that out of? That was... Yeah. That was strong. Um. Take the tall the magic pot. Hmm. Take some magic pot diddler. Pot diddler. <laughs> pot diddler. He did. Cancel him. Tiny pot, little pot. <laughs> I need you pot if you only do. If I was that pot. <laughs> I go inside of you. This is problematic. Come on. Take care. This is in fact, which will be in the second shampoo. Well, <laughs> of course. You know what? But I kind of want mine to be softer, and Brie was saying I'm only going to choose that with beard oil. Yeah. Be beard oil. Oh, oh yeah. man. So many times. He's so good. He's don't listen to you. Yeah, so that's it, guys. If you that's the side of it, then you don't have to be itchy, then using a like, beard shampoo sometimes. No, I've been stopped. And no, I've been stopped. Then also, when you get out of the shower, drying off, and even putting off like, beard oil in it, it really helps. Yeah. And it makes it. Oh. I was telling oil is definitely. Yeah, I have told Yeah. Oh my god, I hate Holden's weed. It's the worst. Careful, careful, mister. Is that, yeah. oh, I've got to stop jumping. Yeah, on that. you gotta be careful. It's just gonna always keep getting me. Ah, oh, more worms! You gotta learn the craft. The craft of. Shaving? Shaving's hard, man. No, I've been stopped! I suck at shaving. No, my Kiraga oh. didn't hit! Yeah, you're. My Kiraga didn't hit! <laughs> oh, God, no! I was like a half. You were really close. You were really, really close. You almost had it. But he's got you now. <gasps> You're alive! You're alive! Go! Oh. That was amazing. I don't know how. I don't know how either, but you got it. You got him. Goodness me. He's not back. Oh. I don't know how that missile hit. It's so little. That was yeah, nuts. Uh, let's <laughs> see what happens. No, it's Sue. All right. Was that? <laughs> Control is really hot. Was that the Hollander Hollander we just killed? Or? Uh, is he dead dead? I wonder. Probably. He might be dead dead now. I mean, he He just, definitely just live streamed. He diffused out. Yeah. All right, so that's Hollander. Hmm. Gone. There's no more running. No more running. Jake okay, Piss, what shaver do you use? It's been a long time. You're getting cuts. His was hard. <laughs> So, what happened? That thing wasn't so tough. I can't mm -hmm. fight like a first. I'm just an angel copy. Copy? Is Zach thinking he's the actual angel? Yeah, I think so. It's Lazard. Mm -hmm. 
So, Starting you're it. the one who helped Hollander out of Junon? <clears throat> why would you do such a thing? Yeah, why? Mm, why, bro? To exact my revenge. I needed Hollander. I mean, why does Lazard want revenge? You really mm. chose the wrong friends, didn't you? Words? I agree. I never dreamed I'd be turned into an Angeal copy. Jeez. Well, just be happy you're linked to Project G. It's a strange feeling. Hmm? The lust for vengeance that had so consumed my life is all but gone now. What was Lazard wanting revenge over? It's a desire to help you. Mm. A desire to save Genesis. I wonder. No. It's bigger than that. I. Oh, is that coming from Angel? Like that, that sense? The world. Mm. Well, his personality. A bit, a bit of Angel's sort of mimetic legacy has mm. yeah, made maybe. Lazard want to. Perhaps. Want to be bigger. But yeah, he is. He's Shinra's bastard son. Mm. Lazard, he's. Mm. Nothing strange about that. Poor fella. Rufus's half brother. Angeal lives inside you. Mm. <laughs> what a post shock. Genesis mm. is a short and apple. The gift of the goddess. <laughs> but what is it exactly? <clears throat> no. Whatever it is, he must be stopped. He must. He must. I just don't understand what he's talking about at all. What should I do? You have no deeper thinking, Zach. <clears throat> Perhaps. The Maybe. TV's now starting to flicker, guys. Yeah. So. Ah. It was working for a bit, guys, but now it's back to, uh... So, goo. Zach, goo what goo. is your dream? Huh? Oh. Let's see. To become a hero. Yay. Why are you gonna say it like that? To become a hero. Best kind. Oh, come on. <laughs> Lend me a hand. You and Angeal both. If we pull this off, we'll all be heroes. At the very least, what I feel Zach. like one. Yeah. Do you even know what you're fighting for? <laughs> so, Zach, where is Genesis? In a cave. I think. I see. Benora? Hey, Benora? Benora? Benora got yeeted. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When are they going to release jetpacks? When we like. Mm. I know they're already starting to go onto the market. I'm just thinking, like, we've got to get a flight, man. We've got to head down to the airport in like five days. All the palaver of that. Just imagine if we could just... Yeah, that's mm. so uncomfortable to be. No, I mean, it's like, they're going to fly over to Benora now. Right, should, should we leave this? Because we're still cutting out, man. We're still cutting out. Yeah, I think we might. I feel like it, it, it sucks. Don't want I don't the wanna... end of the game it sucks. to us not enjoy it. Because yeah. at the end of the day, like, you guys might be able to see it. Yeah. But I want to see it. Yeah, I want to see it. Yeah, guys, it's unfortunate, but I think we'll leave it there. Yeah. And all it means is that we'll have a bit more extra time to uh well, we're gonna put the forespoken vid out yeah. i know guys give me some advice yeah I, I, i'm putting the forespoken vid out Sh should i just leave it should i not touch this is it like crypto is it like blockchain gaming back in the day i used to have no problems making these kind of controversial videos with a bit of heat and a bit of rage and a bit of angst back in the day people weren't as offended by stuff though i think mm. These mm. days, I feel like people just get offended so easily. Over well, stuff. what exactly is it that you're saying in the video? Like, are you saying something that could be or kind of like, I told fun? So. I feel like I'll have, I would have to see it to give you proper Maybe, advice. What if we took elements of the video, but did what you said about doing comparing it to the Agony's philosophy thing and talk about Agony's philosophy a bit and certain theories in terms of? Well, I want to cover the Agony's right, philosophy well. thing. Maybe don't put this one out and actually just tie mm. it all in together. Like sort of... I'm still going to do the Agnes philosophy thing, mm. but I don't know. All I'm saying in this is that Square have failed. Square have failed in their attempt to take down the West, play the West at their own game. Now, yeah. this has been an era in the making, this whole luminous 
saga. Mm. And all it's done is what pain. It's not it's not it's, been worth it. It's, it's done not... to play against what your strengths are. It's like yeah. you also have to understand that we are in an era of weaves becoming more powerful. This is the ma this like, is the main point. It, it's it's true. It's like people are becoming they're coming around to anime more, mm -hmm. like it's becoming more yeah. of a normalized thing. More people are consuming it. Why are you trying to deviate away from something that is your strength? Yeah. You know? It's it's just, it is a little bit silly. And that's the thing. I yeah, I agree that for spoken probably is mid but when you get a mid product when people have dropped 70 dollars or like 30 40 hours whatever of time investment mid they get really angry about about mid because mm. you know they don't get the serotonin feedback they want and they, they will rate that thing low but yeah the, the whole thing that frustrates me is exactly what Bree said it's like the 90s and the 2000s and i say this all in the vid and this is one i'm looking at releasing mm. Square were the ones who carved a path for Japanese storytelling, mm. Japanese aesthetics, Japanese mm. designs. And now it's hit like critical mass and you've even got Western developers trying to capitalize on it because there's such an appetite for it. Yeah. And this would have been Square's opportunity to be leading on this front. Instead, they pivoted West. Silly. You've decided to go West when the rest of well, you've, you've done all the work Square in pulling the, you know, the gaming scene East. Mm. This was your time to own it. And instead you got, you got what? You got insecure about your style. You got insecure about your culture. You started trying to, because it, it wasn't just like well designed, because yeah, it's engine that will beat the West. You know, gamers in the West, they want big mm. open worlds. They're obsessed with open worlds. The bigger, the better. They're obsessed with, no, a, a simplistic story because Westerners don't understand complex shit. Yeah. This was all in their narrative when they were saying it. One thing I've been thinking over the last few days, have they actually lot, have they actually finished their conquest to take over the West, though? I mean, mm. when you look at 16, how many Western influences has that got? Well, that's mm. the thing. Well, like, the, the, it's, not a bad, it's not a bad thing to have Western influences yeah. because, you know, mm. Seven had it, eight had it, like, yeah. lots of games had it. I mean, it's all based on English folklore. Like, yeah. Square have always, well, they used to be really good at getting that dance just right. Yeah, they, like, it's like... You put in Western a, a elements, movie. yeah, that, like, pull them in, draw them in, they're like, and then you, you drop your culture on them. Because hmm. at the end of the day, it's that. way more of a, you know, it's, it, it's a JRPG. It's very clear. Mm -hmm. It reads like that, but it does have elements that I feel like that's why Seven blew up the way that it did. It's like people could connect with that because it's like Shinra. Yeah. Shinra's real, you know, mm -hmm. essentially. Like it's, oh, yeah. there, there's a lot of stuff that speaks to Westerners yeah. and it kind of makes the anime bits and the JRPG bits more easily mm -hmm. con consumable for them. So to, to have it blow up the way that it has over like the past several years, it's like more people, mm -hmm. normies, are enjoying it. Enjoying like, it. Exactly. The amount of people that I see that are looking at 16 that just really aren't fans of Final Fantasy, that have bad shit to say about it, that are kind of more like they stay away from it, they're excited about it. Mm -hmm. it, it it's it's become more of a normalized thing. Yeah, because because 16 is a game done right. Hmm. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It, it's no we we people come to Square Enix and what Japanese storytelling thrives on is having a complexity to it a philosophy mm. to it you know, a thematic depth to it something that you can't really like fully immerse people in mm. in an absolute behemoth of an open world game it gets lost in it mm. you know so 16 you know being pretty linear in mm. its structure and yeah like yoshi p got that and people will come out oh 16 not open world man who cares Fuck these people the with the open yeah. world obsession. It doesn't need to be obsession. that. Exactly. Yeah, there's games Yoshi for that. Yoshi P game, it's like, no, don't yeah. play 14. Yeah. That's, yeah. you don't need your... And like, and like Yoshi P had to come out and adjust, like, in an interview and justify uh, his choice. He was like, oh yeah, because of the time skips, and uh, these time skips are important to the story, mm. telling a story and the epic drama that we want 16 to be. Mm. If we tried to do this open world, it would take about 15 years to make this game. 15 years to make. Look at that. Yeah. So now 16 is a prime example of just a single yeah. mainline JRPG. It's not going to have uh, parts of the story and the resolution hidden behind paywalls. It just is going to be it. 
I know it's gonna pop off. People just keep really saying the same off. thing, but it's like the same people that are like, oh, I want to open world, are the people that wanted to open world in 15 and then complained about it. Because yeah. let's be honest, it, it, as far as open world games go, 15 was pretty shit for it. There wasn't it was anything in there. It was, it was just a big nothing burger. Mm -hmm. There's so much open, useless space with useless side quests. I love 15, don't get me yeah. wrong. I love that fucking game, but yeah. it had so it well. many yeah. Just mistakes that could have made it so much better. And this it is, could have been great. And this is what I'm called Battle 14 uh, in the Forspoken video as well. Mm. Where, like Dust Guy, Dust Guy was bland as shit, man. Mm. And like you get all this earthy palette that tries to lean into realism. But what is the, re but we're in a high fantasy game. And, and it's like, yeah. What is the realism actually there for? Because in a high fantasy game, it's like, I want that wow element. I want to see mm. colors and color palettes that mm. I can't see in the real world. Mm. So then why do we have all this earthy grayness, hmm. like brownness and this muddiness yeah. and forespoken? It's like the, yeah. the creatures, the mobs, like they look good, but they're like, are they fucking out there? They're like blending in to yeah. like the blur of everything. And it's like, what's that realism there for? Is it to like make the high fantasy, like carry the story and, and make it that wow thing? Or is it just to flex the technology? And that's all forespoken really is. It's yeah. just a technology yeah. flex, man. Yeah. But I don't know, the main thing that people are gonna get really pissy about I think with my full spoken vid because mm. I said I knew that it would get review bombed and I knew that there would be valid reasons and valid criticisms but I'm also pointing out that I know that some of the review bombs will be on some petty pathetic trivial ass shit that I hate and it was before the game came out for Woken that is mm. woke that is woke the game's woke it's got a matriarchy it's got a black female it's woke and shut the fuck up with this woke stuff already people overuse any kind of word like that but they overuse definitely... the woke Ugh. um so i knew it, but I, that's the thing i factored that in when i guessed that game score mm. basically guys I, I guessed in forespoken's demo that it would get a 3.8 the game got 3.6 I'm always right. I mean, I, I pretty much am, right? <laughs> I pretty much fucking am. All the time. But yes, it's, 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 my, it's my head But you're right this time. I'll give you that. I mean, yeah, should I be humble with it? Oh, oh well, you know, I could have been wrong. It, it maybe it could have been a seven. I just didn't know. No, I fucking knew. I knew. <laughs> I knew down to the core why it was going to be that. Um, oh, but then at the, at the same time, could the other flip side to it, because it's like... Call out the people who just call it all woke, mm. you know, and, and that is appealing to, you know, it's just virtue signaling to people. Mm. But on the flip side, you've also got the same people who kind of do prove the woke thing, mm. right? Where like, and I had this with playing the demo. Oh, Pez, you're usually so open-minded with mm. games. You, you, you usually never prejudge a game before it comes out. It seems strange to me that you're doing it now when the main character happens to be black. I right, come on. Come you're on. Just, you're just putting shit together See, where it isn't. Does that make you racist to say that shit? Is that you being I racist? Think to, to assume that? Because you're you're putting everything through the lens of race when it's it's really It's not. You're making it about something that it isn't. And mm -hmm. I feel like a lot of times people are just like because they feel so strongly in their opinion about something, like you have to be wrong. Your opinion has to be wrong. So you must be racist. Yeah. It must be that. It can't be anything else. And, that, and, and it's just like, <laughs> yeah. come on, bro. And that's it, the funny thing. You've got these two people in the extreme and you've got uh, like basically the bigots who yell over the fence at all the people who are woke. And then you've got the actual woke people who are yelling over the fence that everything's bigoted. Mm. And it's just these two sides that are just, Basically saying, well, if you hate the game, you're this, mm. and if you love your game, if you love the game, you're this. To love it is woke, and to hate it is to be a bigot. Yeah. And that there's no middle ground. There's no in between. There's no other justifiable reason why you cannot like Forspoken. Mm -hmm. yeah. For me, it's because I don't ideologically agree with it. That Square Enix backed off of you know, representing their culture. Yeah. And like being confident and unashamed with that shit, and not moving into this insidious like bullshitty wishy-washy western pandering it has good bits it, like there's parts of it that look good but for the most part mm -hmm. it's like the dialogue how important is dialogue in a game to me it's really fucking important and even only just playing the demo i was getting annoyed yeah. like yeah. It, it, yeah. it's it's annoying 
So it's like, I don't know, dude. I just... You can turn it off, like I said to you yesterday. Yeah. Previously, mm. full, oh, the dialogue might be a bit much. Yeah, like, so what game does that? Turn it down, so Who... it's not as bad. What mm. game do you know of, any game that you know of, where they turn off, like, you have an option to turn that off? Yeah. Like, that's... That's interesting. Yeah. It's very telling. Yeah, and that's the thing. They, they knew there were loads of problems before Spoken. That's why the review blocked it. That's why they added these things to into it. Does anyone have Pez has played uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild? I have not, Helena. Ooh. Also, hello, mate. We're going to have hello. to do that. No, I haven't. Um, oh, and Novus even said <laughs> that's a great idea for Bree and him to <laughs> to play. Yeah, I, I would love to play that with you. It's Zelda Breath of the Wild. Yeah, really? we can play it. 15 it's a really good game. I think game. once we start playing, yeah. it's going to do it. Um... <laughs> I actually agree with you, Jake Pierce, and I sort of mentioned mm. in the vid where there are moments of dialogue with Frey where it actually sounds like a real conversation. Mm. I think she takes the piss out of the calf. Again, this is all in the vid if I release it. I think I will. Mm. I will. Some people are going to get pissy. Some people are going to get uh, hyperbolic with it. Some people are going to call me a racist. Yeah. Not liking it. And the thing that at least to me proved that it's not racist is I reminded Brie of uh, Agni's philosophy, which is what was spoken essentially is. Mm. Um, Showed, showed Brie the trailer. She had seen it, but it was kind of fresh for you for a moment. Yeah. Because you'd forgotten about it. I forgot about it. And I before, forgot it was a thing. Before Agni even took her hood off, hmm. you're watching it and you're like, oh, wow, shit. this is intriguing. This hmm. is dark. This is gritty. This looks awesome. Wow, this is really... A feeling hmm. that I haven't had on a single Forspoken trailer. Hmm. Hmm. I haven't had. It doesn't have the vibes. And it, 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 she hadn't even taken her hood off. Yeah. So it wasn't even about whether she was white or whether she was black. Mm. It's just that Agni's philosophy, she actually looked like she was a part of the world. Mm. The, the, the story was showing, <clears throat> the atmosphere was stronger. Yeah. She wasn't some isekai that was just dunked in it, mm. chatting mad, nonsensical shit. Mm. Which I don't mind the nonsensical shit. Like, mm. Freya is F-bombing all the time. Yeah. Talking to the cuff, like calling him a serial killer. And some of it is like... Damn, that's a real conversation. Like, mm. that's actually how I would chat to some mates. Yeah. Like, mm. it's got that banter that... Because mm. it is, it's a Western game. Let's, let's put it this way. It's, it's written by Western writers. So the banter mm. and the cringe. Because that's the thing, every game has an element of cringe. You're going to tell me Final Fantasy don't have some cringe? Oh, for sure. It has cringe. And when, when Westerners who don't play Square Enix <laughs> or Eastern games look at that cringe, they go, oh my God, cringy, weeby. Mm. We go, oh, we love it. We laugh at it. We yeah. find it hilarious. Yeah. But then when it's Freya doing all like her F-bombs and a kind of like New york -y, kind of edgy, like Western banner, but we, we've come to Square Enix for weeb cringe. We want weeb not, cringe. Not Western cringe. Yeah, Western cringe is too much. So we don't find it funny. <laughs> we, we just cringe. We yeah, just go, we just go, ugh. <laughs> This is not enjoyable cringe. <laughs> it's true. There's there's different there's different categories of cringe. Some is yep. watchable and some just makes you feel sick. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But But that that's all subjective. That's all mm, subjective. Mm. Uh, yeah, it's all opinion based. And that's what really pisses me off is people sitting here thinking, like, oh well you can't have this opinion or my opinion is right. Because at the end of the day, it's just it's all opinion based. Yeah. It's all opinion based. Also, for a game to get 3.6, there also has to, be, in my opinion, just be some pretty objective problems. Oh, yeah. Like, that's but still, it. at the end of the day, if somebody yeah. has a different opinion from you, yeah. that doesn't mean try to pick out other things other than the fact that, like, everybody has a valid reason for their opinion, right? For the most part. A lot of people do, typically. Mm -hmm. So, rather than focusing on what they're saying, because people will tell you, okay, I have this opinion and this is why. Why try to dig underneath that and try to find something completely irrelevant yeah. and make it like, no, this is the reason why you think like that. I, Don't tell me why I think the true. way I think. It's, it's, that is so, so true. And I, that's the thing. I, I had that with the, the crypto vids. Mm. I've had that when I've spoken before spoken. It's mm. like people will come into the comment section and they'll come up with all of these speculations on why I'm... I'm not liking liking this thing and they'll mm. place it on insidious reasons like i've just done half an hour video telling you directly why i don't like it you don't need to dig try to dig under me on this like Bless you. i'm telling you <laughs> why i don't like it mm. i'm telling you what my bias is mm. i'm even in my owning where some of that bias is unfair and mm. it's purely subjective mm. you're like no let me, let me get my little detective hat on 
Let me make it deeper than what it is. Let me tell you. Let me tell you why you think the way you do. Yeah, and it's because you're a, you're a shit You're a bad man. Bad, bad, naughty man. I remember whenever we were doing the stream, somebody, I didn't say anything, but it was, it was my first stream as well, so I was also just like, I don't know what to do. Well, spoken was your last st first stream. It was my first stream with you. Shit. And yeah, I was, yeah. I was seeing somebody that kept on left, like, leaving this comment about him, like essentially just basically saying that he's racist. And they kept saying stuff like that. Yeah. And it was really pissing me off. I'm like, he hasn't mentioned anything about her. He keeps talking about like, oh, story, this, that, the other thing. Mm -hmm. And like talking about like Square and all this other shit. I'm just like, people really be reaching. Oh yeah. Hard. Oh yeah. Hard. And it's like, why are you looking at everything through the lens of race? Yeah. A game can be shit. If she was white, the game would still be shit. Yeah. If she was Asian, the game would still be shit. If mm -hmm. her personality was still like that, if the story was still Hell like that, if the dialogue yeah. was still like that, it's like you can have an opinion. Get it, Brie. Yeah, it's just, it, Get ooh, it. it makes you angry. It, ooh. Does. <laughs> it was, it was, it really like, and that was the thing that I kind of, I was like, oh, you can't let stuff like that bother you too much. But I, I got quiet for a second after I saw it, yeah. and I was just like, oh, people are mean. <laughs> yeah, Ginch has had uh, a few moments like that on the streams where he comes out and he's like, dude, like, mm. man, this person made this comment. It's like, right, I'm like, man, mm. you just got to let that shit go. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, you either let that shit go or you... I say it's one or the other, or you then double down on it. Mm. You double down and you make a whole 40 minute video on it. <laughs> and you really care. Mm. <laughs> it works. It works both ways. I've just let it slip. I've just, yeah. Mm. yeah. I'm not like into the I just don't bother with it anymore. It's not. People have their opinions on stuff. And yeah. I got my opinion from Persuade when we played the demo. Like a lot of stuff people mm. have been saying about it is what I saw. Like the combat mm. was fun. Yeah. Um, I found the parkour okay like i did think like somebody, somebody said it was like a bit of an old hmm. it was clunky in areas like hmm. being yeah. run up i didn't like the fact that you could not run up by the side of cliffs and things like yeah that. i thought that would have been cooler hmm. um but yeah i just found like the open world bit was it was a bit bland yeah and it's a nothing burger it's the same thing i had with mgs5 I've, I've mm -hmm. brought up a few times i really enjoyed metal gear solid 5 but hmm. they shouldn't have gone open world with that because yeah the worlds were dead like the story hmm. was cool but yeah. Yeah. I mean, once I cranked the difficulty up on Forspoken, because it was all you like. You started to enjoy. Oh, it. I was really enjoying it, man. Mm. Real fun, real, real fun mm. elements to it. Um, I'm just seeing if there's anything else out in Forspoken. So mm. I really want to get some sale numbers, but Forspoken is mm. getting review bombed. Oh, I want to click that in a sec. Because what does review bombed mean? What does that act like? What are we saying? To be honest, every game, every like, let's game be gets. real, every game gets review bombed because if people have something they don't like about a game, they're going to give it usually. And they're going to go hard. They're going to go hard because people are yeah. dicks on the internet. It's just the way the internet yeah. is. But it's just sort of saying to me that, oh no, it's not. It's not this, it's getting review bombed. Like there's some sort of other ideological thing going on, some other nefarious agenda well, yeah. outside Every game has game. haters, bro. Every game. Bombing, you usually have, I usually find there's a reason behind the review bombing for it. Mm. Like, like, like God, of War, God of War Ragnarok, that's, that's yeah. a prime example of review bombing. It's Bunch because people were pissy out of the game awards and like, okay, yeah. let's go review bomb. Yeah. You know, people do it. But so that's Sonic that's fans went and review bombed <laughs> Genshin. And Genshin, Genshin did, does suck. Did it I back. shouldn't say that. That's going to make people mad. Genshin is, it was good until it wasn't. Yeah. People are going to be mad about that. I played Genshin for a really long time, so I have a I have a right. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. one of those evil gotchas. No, it's evil, a, nefarious it's a, gotcha. I, I understand review bombing, and you fact <laughs> you factor it in, but to say that a game is only getting low scores because of review, review bombing, I don't know. It, mm. it seems disingenuous. It really, really does. Yeah. I, it, it's a factor for mm. sure, but for sure. <laughs> Um, <clears throat> do you own a Switch, Pez? I did. Um, did you own a Now I don't. Did you have one? I have one. When did you sell that? Didn't even unbox it. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't realize you had I didn't even unbox it. I have one. You I can bring it. I want to buy one and just be like, nah, I won't use it. 
I still love Genshin. I love the story. I think oh, I, I, I stopped liking Genshin kind of right before. I don't even remember what it was, but there was like we were like waiting on an expansion, and once it came out, I was like, dang, I was really waiting for this, and I just kind of realized it's just, I don't know, it fell off for me personally. Yeah, never played it. Yeah, it's it's a trap. Shall we should we get into mobile? Games? <laughs> should we become a mobile game? No. Why not? No, because it's such a like money. I've seen so many of my friends lose so much money on Genshin. Yeah. It's just it's a trap. Yeah. It's a trap. For sure. I wonder how fifteen the new empire is still doing these days. Probably <laughs> <laughs> pretty well. I know. On Forspoken Vase sponsored Forspoken stream. So uh, VTubers are really popping off, but Vela Bay had a sponsored stream, basically went on there, half an hour in, game just crashed to a screeching halt. Mm. Optimization issues like crazy. Mm. On the PC, it's terrible, apparently. Be yeah. like that. Right, here we go. I just want to see what game rants means when they say, for spoken game review bombed. Let's see. Uh, players leave remarkably negative reviews for Square Enix flagship release. For spoken, criticizing almost every aspect of the game. Felt victim to a new bout of review bombing. Square Enix latest release, blah blah blah. Uh, with the majority of for spoken reviews being fairly middling, it was implied from the get go that the game wouldn't end up being a sort of smash hit. They may have expected it to be, on top of various technical issues and performance issues. For spoken content isn't getting much praise from most sources either and the players bases issues with the game have now come to a head okay so why does it mean it's getting review bombed yeah if you're saying that there's valid reasons for it to get negative reviews i don't consider that to be review bombing yeah pc metric pages over 100 negative reviews with just over two do dozen positive ones yeah i mean it's not got any better since they wrote this another you say the pc one mm. i'm not surprised they've given them a game that's the PS5 does seem to be more tolerant of the game in a broad sense, while the negative uh, certainly far outnumber those that are positive. The game does enjoy a higher score too, with a 3.7, compared mm. to the PC's version's impressively low 2 out of 10. Jesus. Shit, I didn't even look at them. That's no, wild. Bear critic for spoken PC. I didn't even look Jeez, at it. Jeez, Louise. Ooh, 1.9. 1. Ah, sweet Jesus. There must be some issues there. Well, there's massive issues. You need an NASA supercomputer to make it wrong. Yeah. Maybe the game is supposed to sell more graphics cards because of the hardware. Of box. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. Shit. You can't be releasing games on PC <clears throat> and not optimizing them. Oh, for sure. Like, I, for sure. I'm a PC player and I get sick of it. Mm. You get these brand new, like, even with 15 when they came out, it ran like shit on PC. That was a whole thing. See, and then all they go on to say is, you know, it's got all of these issues. Um, huge open sandbox that focuses first and foremost on entering, entertaining player with its visuals and flashy combat sequences, but it doesn't seem to have paid enough attention to its characters and narratives, as these are the most commonly criticized aspects of the game. Mm. They also say then at Square Enix they didn't send out many copies of Forspoken to reviewers, which could be taken to mean that the publisher wanted to keep things on the down low yeah. as, as much as possible. And that's where it ends. This, so this where what, is the review bombing? Where is the you? review bombing? You're saying that Forspoken has fallen victim to review bombing. Well, why is it a victim? It just fucking sucks in a lot of areas. Okay. Is review bombing this is just this is the thing. thing again? Like, what, what do you mean? The thing that really ticks me off with people complaining about negative reviews, this is just the way that human beings work, right? So for all the people that are complaining that like, oh, the game was actually okay. How many people who say the game was okay or I liked it actually go and leave a review? Probably not that many, right? And these people, it's like, you didn't even leave a positive review. So why are you complaining about all these negative reviews? It's just the way that people work. People are way more likely to engage in something negatively than they are positively. Yeah. That's the way it works with restaurants. That's the way it works with Yelp. That's the way it works with this kind of shit. If you're mad, mm -hmm. if you're mad and you had a shit experience with something, you're going to feel more led to leave a shit review. Sure. And, and that's the thing is sure. like they might, their experience might have been like a, for them personally, yeah. like a one but you might have like, well, it wasn't that bad. Well, for them, it might have been. Yeah. It might have been like a, a nothing burger because that's, they didn't get what they wanted to get out of the game. So it's like, 
it's not some kind of like evil like this game yeah. is this so i'm gonna leave a bad review let's all go and do it like it, it's not always like so that. it, that's the thing it does it makes it sound like there's some sort of coordinated yeah. orchestrated it just kind of sucks <laughs> but, but it's very true there's a reason why the orange section mm. is the least occupied mm. like section because yeah you, you make a good point mm. if you've had a five or six meal mm. you know you're not so pissed and so angry that you want to go on there to yeah to comment about it mm. but then yeah you're also not wowed like, oh my god that was one of the best dishes yeah. i've ever had i want to leave a review mm. saying how amazing that was mm. yeah and even when you do feel like that because i've had plenty people of are usually going to write a review when they feel strong we had great True. meals out here we had this great chicken place that we're like oh i want to oh, go back there that pizza place there. we went back there let's go back to the chicken and place are we leaving a review no but if it was shit and it made us sick are we more likely to leave a bad review yeah the only time i've ever work? left a food, food review it's when we went to Hard Rock Cafe in Niagara Falls. Oh, yeah. The salmon made her <laughs> sick. My food was disgusting. He said it, too. He's I like, you made my girlfriend sick. <laughs> <laughs> I left, like, a, uh, an essay, scathing review. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so if you're complaining about negative reviews, leave a positive one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Be the solution. Mm. Counter it. Or it else, first. shut up. <laughs> yeah. I did it with Fallout 76. I actually enjoyed that game. I was like, yeah. I'm going to leave a good review on it. Yeah. That's been getting review bombed because of people hating it. Mm. Not the Fallout they wanted, but mm. it got me through COVID. So, yeah. 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 If you really love yeah. something, then. I'm going to give yeah. it a good review just because I don't want it to get. Yeah, I mean, what, 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 does, what does Type Zero get these days in terms of review? Because I know back in the day it was like, no. Mm. Stop about food. No, no. I'm going to have to cook. <laughs> Oh, seven and a half. Five. Yeah, nice. Mm. Nice. I mean, theme's nice now. Mm. Like, what's spoken is fucked it. Yeah. Fucked it hard. All right. Anyway, I don't know. Mm. We'll leave it there. I, I will release the vid. I'll put it out. Might as well. Yeah. Might as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If yeah, people yeah. are buttholes and people are buttholes, right? I think I, I just as I'm getting older, I'm getting more sensitive. Mm. When I was younger, I didn't give a damn. Mm. Come at me, bros. Now I'm old, I'm like... Ooh. You were a bit hot-headed. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm not, I'm not as stubborn as I used to be. Could really? You believe it? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Well, You're not that bad. It's free right now on, on the PlayStation. Might give it a whirl. Yeah, give it a go. Yeah. Give it a go. Oh, actually, I enjoy it. If you like exploring, then it's not as bad. Mm. Especially after all the work they've done to it. Like... <laughs> Yeah. Mm. I met all my friends only getting type zero due to the episode Dusk Eye demo. That's how mm -hmm. I got it, man. Yep. That's how I got it. Mm. I loved it. I never even heard of it. I never even heard of it. I was like, what is this? What is this? Oh, well. Because that's how I got it. It came with my, my PS4. Whenever I bought I bought a new PS4 because my old one got curse blatted. I was like, <laughs> oh, this is... This is really good. How come I never heard about this? How come I didn't know this was a thing? Mm. They should have advertised it a lot better than they did, I think. Yeah. Mm. Bullshit, Pez. You can't let <laughs> Pez is becoming a beta, love. It is. <laughs> a beta? Slowly slipping Leave into... Leave him alone. Honestly, I, I feel like... Not a beta. <laughs> you care less now. It's very true. It's very true. Mm. And it's... It's because back in the day, if, if somebody wrote me like a, a glowing comment, mm. oh, yes, mm. I love my stuff. I'm the best. And then if somebody wrote something whole about me, you're like, oh, no, you fucking <laughs> <laughs> right now. You know nothing about me. Yeah. I'm the one of any minute. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what, mate. <laughs> I've got 10 points as to why you're wrong. One. <laughs> um, yeah, now, now it's just less. Mm. I don't know. I think being in this space and getting old, maybe it is there. Maybe I don't, I don't care as much. I feel like it's it's not even a matter of care or not care. I feel like it's the things, the, the degree of which you choose. And also, I feel like reasons why you wouldn't want to put something like that out is because you can't be bothered to deal mm -hmm, with it. Mm -hmm. That's it. Can't be bothered. Well, Scott, one of my favorite videos Pez did was a Caius ballot. Oh, dude, was it the what we can learn from Caius? Hmm. Oh, bro, I put so much work into that vid. I'm so glad you said that. It uh -huh. didn't get the attention it deserved. Man, there are vids that, I mean, our latest, uh, yeah. our latest 16 vid 
it's similar. You work four or five mm. days on it and it gets like 2K views. They worked really hard on that. If you haven't yeah. seen it, it's, it's really good. 2.0, yeah. he did the editing it, for it. it. He did a really good job. There's a really spicy bit. Yeah. Really spicy bit in the middle. Mm -hmm. Nice little reveal. If you haven't seen it, definitely go watch it. Who's watching? Did you enjoy it? Like is there anything you can give them? Oh, the, the comments on it were great. The audience yeah. retention on it was great. But I learned this a long time doing theory vids. Mm. If I could spend four or five days working on a theory vid, mm. it get you know, back in the day five, ten K views. And then I could see an article about Square Enix doing some dumb shit. I flick my camera on mm. and go, fucking I swear what the fuck are you fucking doing this, mate? I fucking hate you, you fucking bastards. Upload it. 60k, 70k, 100k views. People love negative shit. It's in a cycle because the same thing's going to happen now. Mm. Put Work four or five days on something passionately yeah. that I've thought about, that I've scripted, that I care about, that I think is you're cool. You're going to put out this you forespoken video yeah. and you're going to get... This forespoken video will <laughs> pop... The, f the hell off compared to yeah. people love negativity. negativity so so that's how if you ever wonder how so many youtubers get into this like groove of just like angrily ranting about what stuff and just reacting and covering controversial shit and why we don't have as many like animators or theory crafters or lore junkies or, or all of these other areas that YouTube used to have. It used mm. to be such a beautiful playground of all kinds of content and creativity. No, YouTube and the internet decided we want controversial, angry, yelly, ranty, bullshitty, half-truthy, noncy, mm. posted every single day, as many vids as possible, five, six, get vloggy with it, diminish mm. your quality, fuck it, fuck it all. I, I, I hate it, but that's how YouTube's gone. Yeah, that's unfortunate. And the main thing, yeah, the main thing is you just got to... Uh, because the, the problem is if you follow the formulas too much, you'll end up doing it and you won't love. Yeah. You won't love what you're doing. You, you don't come to... Like, don't come to YouTube unless you love what you're doing. Hmm. Elena. Tell me, that's why you come to it. Go to a normal job if you want to. Thank you, Elena. <laughs> hey! Hey, Elena. Mm. Thank you for all the viewers. They're my favourite. Most of the games uh, I buy up because you sing their praises. I don't look at views much. Hmm. Yes, mate. Have you played Neil Automata yet? I think you've already told me, Helena. Have you? I hope so. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we, we're going to trundle along. Like, that's the thing. I don't even know if these 16... We've got four more 16 theory vids. Maybe when they come out and we put them on the playlist and that to watch them together, they'll pop up a bit more. That's the thing. I think once we get them all back to back, Perhaps they'll pop off. the time of 16 coming out, it'll, yeah. people will be like, oh, yeah, I want to look into this sort of stuff. Yeah. So. And it's also, it's doing them, because I, I really enjoyed doing it as a, uh, a premiere. Mm. But you guys in the chat, and we can scat back, but premieres it's, kill. Yeah. Kill it algorithmically. Yeah. It's unfortunate. Because basically how a video performs in the first two hours is like massively important mm. yeah and it just doesn't do as well in yeah. the premiere we have to be a so it's unfortunate yeah but it's a big bummer four more damn guys yeah we got we got barnabas and dion chaos and order, chaos and order. the third one is going to be uh diablos mael yeah uh, there's mm. no more than that yeah figuring out what what clive is what the big villain of the game is going to be um there's something to do with the I know, I'm going to tell just you guys in the chat because there's only 30 people here. But we, we dove down all the biblical and Islamic and Hidrashic stories. And we're pursuing it. And uh, we go to the fall of uh, the temptation story. No, the fall of man, Garden of Eden. Are you dropping big spoilers? Basically, I don't want to say, too, this. I don't say too much. Don't say too much. I, 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 fo I followed this rabbit hole. And then it led me all the way up to the Mark of Cain. Mm. The Mark of Cain. I feel like you might be dropping the Mark. <laughs> Sorry, guys. You have to watch the video. Yeah. Yeah. He almost revealed a juicy bit. That's a juicy bit, babe. Yeah. yeah. No, 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 no. Sorry, guys. He's just spoiling and ruining his own videos. It's like, if you already know the reveal of the whole freaking thing, it, it's not going to hit know. the same. They must know. <laughs> <laughs> Brie has the best suspicious faces, because I knew he was about to do that shit. I knew he was ready to just, like, <laughs> drop a big bit. And then he's like, oh, and you know, these, the, 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 the oh. religious stuff. and blah. I'm like, where are you going with this? Shit. Where are you going? Oh, man. Enjoy it, is it? This boy. Yeah, let them enjoy it. 
Yeah. Okay, yeah, you're right. Just like everybody else. All right. Helena, 100% Neo Automa, all 26 cents. I feel Ooh. like I already knew that. <laughs> it's lit. Oh, God. What Thank you, Brie. You're welcome. See, they, they appreciate me. When did you come to this? <laughs> Man, I need to... Shit. Thing is, I could just get these theories on the fly to a camera, but hmm. I feel like I feel like with the editing, I, it, it, more, it, it takes a lot of work, but it's worth it. Yeah. Mm. It's worth you guys will like it. You guys will like but it. But I'm really annoyed, guys, because I've recorded this like whole theory groove, and then I accidentally deleted and overwrit it. So I, I need to redo it's it. It's okay now. We haven't done like over. Mm. Yeah, yeah, let's, let's, let's hope. Let's hope. Let's hope. <laughs> yeah, he was definitely big cranky on that one. He's like, I'm messed it up. I'll record it over. It's all gone. Pez, do you know about your knit game attack appearing on someone's knit ending? Eh? Did it? I, are you kidding me, Moogle Maid? Who's? Who's sneering you? Who's? Eh? Ah, no way, did it? Oh, I'm about to swoon so hard. Swoon? What was it? Somebody's live stream. <laughs> do you know the ending of Nier? Hmm. You know, if you sacrifice your game save, mm. you, you show up on somebody else's game mm. and you help them destroy the credits. Mm. Apparently, I showed up on somebody's ending. It was commented on your... It was commented on your automatic finale. I have to look at what, that. What, I appeared on somebody else's? Oh, shit, I thought you said, like, an actual streamer. Like, I appeared on the... Oh. <laughs> All right, anyway, we got we got bounce guys because we're gonna yeah we're gonna wrap these videos up. Yeah. Get deep into theories. Most of it because I need to pee. The main thing. You and your weak little baby bladder. I know, I've got a teeny. You got a teeny tiny bladder. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it sucks that we couldn't when finish I need, it today. When but I need we'll, coffee, we're I need gonna to figure this out and have a look. Yeah. Yeah. See if we can get it to be a bit more. Stable. Sorry, guys. Yeah, sorry we couldn't go to the ending, but uh, we're disappointed too. <laughs> we'll either see if we can get the TV sorted here, or we just we might have, have to wait it in the UK. Yeah. We'll let you guys know yeah. what we're going to do. If we're going to finish it in the UK, it'll be a few days before we actually get a chance to do that. Mm -hmm. But Yeah, it'll probably be up. I suppose because Jaden Thomas still with though, so it's going to be a bit difficult. Yeah. yeah. They're still there, so it might be a few weeks. But... So it might, it might be a bit, but we'll, see. we'll, we'll yeah. figure it out and we'll let you know. Yeah. Either way, we're finishing the darn thing. Hell to the yeah! Whether it's here or there. Hell to the yeah! And if not, maybe we can just do some uh, Let's Chat Soju drinking streams. Yeah. Uno. Uno. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, thank you to Helena for the schmeckies, man. Yeah, thanks thank so all you guys. Helena. Everyone hit like. I almost said Elena. Um, oh, uh, uh, great react. Thank you, yeah, mate. Is really anyone else we missed? Um, oh, I would appreciate six, so much. 6 to 6 mm. raided, didn't they? We did. We got um, raided by 6 to 6. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thanks, thanks. Peace out, guys. Hombres. Bye. Tell my dream. See you soon. Wee woo. <laughs> <laughs>